Hey y'all, Ron Burke from Gaming Trend here to show off a pretty sweet toy I just picked up. For those of you who have been long time readers, you know that I've been on a personal quest to fill the bucket list of all the toys my mom never let me have. Helicopters, sharp objects, and especially beanbag chairs. Today we'll be checking out the Sumo Titanium from Sumo Lounge. The Titanium probably gave my delivery guy his workout for the day, uh, as he dropped that onto my doorstep at about 75 pounds. The box didn't fare as well, but thankfully the contents did. Opening the contents of the bag revealed something a little different than the previous sumo chairs I've checked out. No foam peanuts, or at least as far as the eye can see. Once I got the thing free, I could see what looked like a very large brain inside the box. Fairly quickly this brain began to expand into a bag and the race was on to get it zipped into the machine washable corduroy bag. I went with black because it goes with everything, but there's 16 colors to choose from including canary, yellow, and hot pink if that's your thing. You can see the bag requires a little bit of time to fully expand. There will be a lot of slack in the bag for at least the first couple of days. Repeated punching the bag, which by the way is fun in its own right, will break it up, but I simply just applied a squirmy teenager that we've semi-adopted named Seth to take care of that for me. When expanded, the Sumo Titanium measures nearly 8 feet long, 4 feet wide, and holds its shape at nearly 3 feet high. It feels like a piece of furniture, and for gaming sessions, it's pretty fantastic. You can sit on it dead center, and it doesn't compress enough to have you sitting on the floor like other beanbag chairs. Two people can sit on it side by side with plenty of room for true couch co-op or dog or whatever, and all but the tallest of people can lay on it lengthwise if they're so inclined. The MSRP on the Titanium isn't for the faint of heart at $479, but for anyone who's ever priced out even a cheap couch, you probably have a good idea of the value proposition. The futon simply sucks and they hurt your ass. Other beanbag chairs aren't worth the landfill space they'll soon occupy, and as you can see, it fills out the theater nicely for when family and friends visit. It's comfy, and my wife Laura and I have certainly fallen asleep on it more than a few times, as of my dog's Pazuzu, Loki, and Sparky. All things considered, it is Sumo's most comfortable bag yet, easily ticking all the boxes for utility, comfort, and long gaming sessions. If quality is what you're looking for, I highly recommend the Sumo Titanium. Mm -hmm.